What's up guys, it's Draco, and today we're going to be playing some more Project Zomboid. Now I'd also quickly like to thank all the support on last video and teach me how to play the game, and just the community for this brutal ass game was just so helpful. Uh, thanks Larry. Oh, it's Charles, that's his name. I believe I squatted in this home. Charles, after a good night's sleep, he's a new man now. Now he knows all sorts of great tips and tricks to be a better zomboider project or whatever this game's about. Hey, let's just go and wander out. Am I wearing two... Oh no, it's belt left, belt right. I thought I was wearing two belts. And just like the comments suggested, I have combat outlining on. Aha, there we go. So I know when to swing. Back off, would you? And someone said there was a stomping button, but... I, I forgot what button. Uh, I'm gonna take your underwear to where I pissed in mine, so I need a new pair. Stay away from me, pal. Oh, he's got a knife in his bag. Must have pissed off the ex-wife, huh? Should've done this to her. Oh, no. Okay, I'm getting overrun. This is when I start to panic. Just thin in the herd. Okay, never mind. It's a big herd. <laughs> run, Charles, run. This is what my grandma meant when she thought all these young ladies are after me as a handsome young boy. Because I don't like them. Okay, do I sit and fight? But Charles has had a good life. I kind of want it to continue. Oh, he's getting moist. Slightly damp rain or sweat. I think that moistness is coming from my pants. I've pissed myself again. And all the zombies will have to hop over it and I can bonk them on their heads. Okay, that's a bad idea. That was a bad idea. That was a dumb idea. How did they do that? All right, I'm just gonna wander through the woods again. Fuck <laughs> this. It's too scary. I'm not brave. Who am I kidding? Oh my god, they're still following me. They're still following me. Go, 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 Charles, go. Bob and weave, bob and weave. All right, my heart is starting to slow down. I think we're in the clear now. I mean, like, zombie-wise, we still got plenty of woods to go here. Those zombies must have been like my horse from Red Dead, where they just decide to run square into a tree, and then they die. There's gonna be a zombie that'll jump scare me and Charles here, and I'm not looking for- Oh my god! <laughs> what the hell? Is there a bus stop at this road? Why are there so many zombies at this road? Okay, a, a Tomato will get rid of some of my thirst, so I'm just gonna eat a tomato raw, which sounds disgusting. Kinda just wanna make it to the road, but there are so many zombies on the road, I don't know why I would wanna go there. I'm just hoping it could bring me to a town or something where I could actually loot some houses or something. Like in a power speed walking competition. And I think I'm winning. Oh, is this a house over here? I think I found a house, finally. Yes! Oh, it's a gas station. Now oh, come on, you guys are closed up? I'm your only source of business right now, you dumbasses. Banging on the doors. Could you feck off or close? Oh my god! All right, grab everything you can from the cash register. Are those cigarettes and matches. Oh god, okay, okay. Quit screwing around, I'm getting the hell out of here. Actually, I have an idea. Could I go to the parking lot, hit a car, and set off the car alarm? Would they be attracted to that in any sort of way? Like, what if I just hit the hood of this car? No, it does nothing. There might actually be a hundred zombies behind me, but I'm too scared to look. This whole surviving is winning thing doesn't feel like winning anymore. Okay, I actually almost just got bodied by that one homeless man not even wearing a shirt, I don't think. Right, at least we're in a town now. We can actually maybe be a functioning member of society instead of sitting in the woods. Okay, uh, maybe, maybe no zombies saw me go in here. I could be in the clear. Oh, yes, I can drink from the toilet. Mmm water is this some bleach oh there better be some motor oil in here i love motor oil gotta drink it before it expires you know screwdriver and a wrench i know someone said screwdrivers are very helpful so i'll take that even though i don't know how the hell to use it i'll just pretend yeah disassemble the paper towel dispenser wait what did he say i was speeding up time i couldn't read it in time probably something like oh yeah i'm so smart okay but my scratch is gone on my hand where did they come from okay well we have the back door luckily how the hell did I know I was in here? Must have heard me disassembling the paper towel holder. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna avoid- Okay, there's a ton of them! Where did you guys come from? I was sneaking the whole time! This trailer park blows. Is that man naked alone in his bathroom? I kind of want to intrude on him and beat the bejesus out of him. Yeah, come on out, pal. Unlock the window, dumbass. Come on out. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh my god, there are so many of them. The whole trailer park's after me. Alright, I might be able to single a few of them out. Oh wait, no, I have the screwdriver equipped. I do not want the screwdriver equipped. Where's my hammer? Where's my hammer? Where? Oh, there it is. Okay. That would have been bad if I started swinging at him with a screwdriver, because it would have took me a long time to notice. Surviving is winning. Surviving is winning. And I am surviving. Might not be thriving, but I am surviving. Back you, pal. Get the hell away from me. God, I'm so locked in. I'm barely talking right now. And it's <laughs> literally two zombies because I, I think I broke that old woman's hip or something back there. Yes, there's one. There we go. I just want to live in one of your trailers. 
Military boots. Yeah, actually, I, I will wear those. Give me better defense for my little feetsies. Oh my god, I think I actually took on some zombies and survived, like, a little mini attack there. Forget about the ha a heart attack I must had. Poor feckin' Charles here. Yeah, I know you're getting hungry, Charles. If you can break into this home, we might survive. These vitamins? Um, I will just take them all right now. I'm sure I'll be fine. Charles here is a pharmacist. He knows better. Wash all my clothing. Yes, okay. Let's speed that process up a bit, shall we? I'm drowsy. I could do with a little lie down. I thought I had those vitamins. I thought I'd be fine. Fine. Can I eat some olive oil? Oh hell yeah! Let's have let's have a quart of that right now. Mmm, olive oil. All right, I think Charles is ready for bed. He just needs a little uh, sippy sip of water, and we'll be good to go. Hopefully, nobody intrudes on me. Is that possible? Can somebody intrude on you in the middle of the night? Jesus, I have so many ripped sheets. I I could I could drop a few. I okay, I dropped them all. You just grab half of them. Jesus, Charles. What's the middle of the night now? It's four o'clock in the morning. Me and Goblin Mode heading to the kitchen. Looking for some meat sticks. It's either that or I get one of those like pretzel sticks and I pretend I'm Tommy Shelby smoking a cigarette in the kitchen in the middle of the night. Alright, this woman is trying to open a door with her head. I don't blame her right now. This place kind of blows. Shit's kicking off. It's four in the morning. I'm feeling it right now. Just had some stone gummies and I'm ready to go. Come on, one of your windows has to be unlocked. Surely you're like, oh, it's a zombie apocalypse. Why would I lock the windows? Every window is locked. I don't believe it. Alright, and I'm definitely not breaking a window because everyone in this trailer park would be very upset. I do want those cigarettes though. How did I wake you up? There's not a chance. Those zombies are extremely light sleepers. Another thing that's helpful with the combat outline thing is that it shows when they're dead because they'll no longer be outlined. You know, payphone. If I had a quarter, I could call my mom. Disassemble payphones. Do, do I want to do that? Eh, sure, why not? You failed to produce any usable materials. Okay, that bush moved again. I have the screwdriver in my hand. God damn it, Charles! Back off. Yeah, now I'll stand on both of you. There we go. No, you sit back down there. Dumbass. A leather jacket, some earrings. I think it's a sign that I should wear some earrings. I know I'm in the middle of combat, but I'm putting on some silver hooped earrings. Hell yeah. Oh my god, are there masked bandits in there? Was this place getting robbed? Ooh, this woman has a backpack. Okay, and she has a lot of friends. You know, I think on second thought, I'm gonna be getting the fuck out of here. Poor Charles, he had one good night's rest, and now he's back to this. Surviving is winning, though. I don't remember who said that, but surviving is winning. All right, bye, Scenic Grove. It's been real. Killed like eight of their residents and fell asleep on a bed. Just out of curiosity, how do I repair a hammer and wood glue? That's two different types of glue and two different types of tape. Hopefully I just find a new weapon soon. I also have two screwdrivers. Let me drop one. I dropped both. Of course I did. I'm just wandering down the road again. Who's this old fart? Come here, old man. Your time is now. Ooh, this thing just one shot him. Oh my god, this thing's OP! How long has this been in my inventory? You know, I, I I think I'd rather not know. Okay, I am actually pretty competent in combat now. I, I get quiet and I have to focus up. Okay, I either heard a frog or a freaking bear in these woods, and I don't know if either are in this game, so I'm terrified right now. I made it to like a, a track of some sort? What the, uh, like a horse racing track? Is there anything I can loot is all I care about. Yeah, it's like a little obstacle course where you go and see the horses jump logs and stuff, I think. Guessing this is the stables where all the horse would be? Because I see- Hey! Oh my god! You son of a- I don't care how tired you are, Charles. Kill this son of a bitch. No! I've been bitten! How? I have these long- I have this varsity jacket. Oh my god. That feckin' iPad kid just bit right through my varsity jacket. That's- that's some tough A-grade leather right there that you just bit through. God- Damn it. Charles, you were going to be a staple on the series, man. You were going to be the one. Yeah, definitely the longest I've survived. How long has it been? A day and 11 hours. So a day and a half, roughly. I got to know. I, I feel like I'm unlucky. I really don't think that zombie should have bit me at all. I'm surprised he even did more than a scratch. This place is locked. You know what? Whatever. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm not dying without my cowboy hat. No, please. Let me die with my cowboy hat on, please. Please do me a favor and drop an R.I.P. Charles in chat. And I wanted you guys to know that his final words were to like the video and subscribe if you are new. Because I'm trying to get 3,000 subscribers before the end of the year. So if you guys could help me out with that, that'd be amazing. Thank you and enjoy the rest of the video. For those of you wondering, these have been my traits that I've been going with for most of the game. Except for carpentry, I just added that. Oh my god, I started in a house. So I'm not immediately getting murked. I could just eat uncooked chicken. I'll take a fourth. Why not?
<laughs> Ew, gross. Yeah, see, now I'm just playing with poor Marshall's life. I lost Charles, and now I don't care about anyone. I have nothing in this house. This poor Marshall guy must have been depressed. I, I have nothing. I, I don't even have a weapon. I have a, a can opener and some uncooked chicken. Oh, and there's zombies in here, too. There, there's nothing even in the place. All right, on to the next house. These are my favorite starts when I can't even find a weapon. This might be a church. Okay, I don't care. Okay, never mind. I care. Okay, the door's unlocked. This isn't a very holy place. This is a shitty place place I hop over the fence you little idiots okay never mind there's more and i just dove into a bunch of them god damn you mark you know you deserved it you deserved it all you had was soup and a can opener what what am i supposed to do with that all right jacoby are you wearing goggles okay you know what i respect the man and i respect you so much you're gonna eat an entire block of cheese being constipated might actually help so zombies don't smell your shit from a mile away. We're gonna get one of these starts where I saw it with nothing. I found one saw. I will take that. I didn't even know that you could can a potato, but I'll take it, whatever. A rolling pin, you know what? I'll take everything. Oh, I think I want to do some clown makeup. Absolutely. Yes. <laughs> oh, poor Jacoby. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Okay, we're out of here. We're out of here. We're out of here. Oh, school. This would be a fun place to make like a shelter or something. Except for I'm not allowed near schools. We'll have to make an exception. There's no police to stop me. Okay, now where would they have weapons in a school? Probably the worst place to be in a zombie apocalypse. All right, I'm in a classroom. Anything in the desks? Come on, a kid didn't bring like a, a like a baseball bat to school for career day or something. Oh yes, a janitor's closet. Bleach. Okay. No, it's not what I'm looking for. Oh my god, there's three of them. There's three of them. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. Just keep fighting for your life. Oh my god. I have no idea how I'm alive. Okay, there are a lot of people here. Oh, oh, this is a bathroom. <laughs> no, no, this is it. No. Oh, wait, I have my bit. No, I, I think that's where we're going to leave it for now for Project Zomboid. Once again, thank you guys for all the support on last episode, teaching me the ways. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you are new, consider subscribing. And in the meantime, check out some more of my videos here, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.